Hey everyone, just wanted to show you something I got. Picked up the flea market a couple months ago for uh, five, six bucks. Um, it is a professional photo vest. Now I've been looking for a vest, like a survival vest. I can keep this in the van, use it when I go hiking. Me and the boys go hiking and everything. And I don't have a big backpack on my back. I mean, this thing is loaded. I'm trying to do this one hand. It's loaded with pockets. I mean, it is just, it is totally loaded down with pockets. Um, let me turn it over here. This, it's got a big pocket. It goes all the way through here. Got pockets on this side, but I'll show you what this is. Yeah, it's showing the pockets. It's vented, you know, it's got a mesh back here, but let me flip it over. It's got a pocket back here, vents where you keep you cool, or I can, in the back, I can put a um, tarp in there. It's got adjustable side straps, but for five dollars, can't beat it. Um, some ideals, you know, a small knife with a sharpening stone, Leatherman tool, rope, little mess kit I can fill up. What I want to do though with this, like my, you know, my mess kit, um, medical kit, fire kit, I want to use containers. So when I put it in the pocket, it don't get wet. You know, if I get caught in a rainstorm, I'll have my important items sealed so they're not being wet. But for five dollars, five, six bucks, I can't remember. I think it was five dollars. This is a pretty good deal to have for a survival vest. It's also, say in a bug out situation, you can throw this on, you can have extra gear along with your backpack, and it's not bringing attention. It's gray, so it kind of blends in. You know, it's not camo, it's not black, it's not red, it's not orange. Kind of like a gray, dull color that fits in. But um, in the comments, if you guys want to leave your comments of what I think I should put in it, um, any ideas or suggestions and I'll go from there. It's going to take me a few days to really think and put in what I want to put in. I don't want it super heavy, but I don't want it super light. I think I can put a lot in here and the way it's laid out, it's going to be a, you know, carry the weight. It's going to distribute the weight better. But granted, I'm still going to have, you know, some type of water container. Let it be a canteen, a sawyer, water filtering system, you know, something that I'm going to have on my side along with a knife and my pistol. So that way, you know, I know that I can get water. I have protection. I have a way, you know, a knife to build shelter, but I am going to use this little knife for cutting, you know, cutting the rope, cutting string, you know, cleaning animals, skinning animals, but I'll have a bigger knife if I need to, you know, chop down bigger stuff to make a shelter. But after I get it all done and laid out, uh, you know, I'll do a video telling you everything I got, but I think it's pretty cool. I think it's a great find, especially this pocket here. I mean, you could put a lot just in this pocket alone. But yeah, when you're out at yard sales, flea markets, look for this stuff. You know, it, it um, don't cost much and the way this economy is, every penny counts. Um, but it, it's, um, I think it's a good find. Just tell me what you guys think. I hope everybody's safe.
prepping. And I'll see you on the next one. Bye for now, guys.